We're all familiar with motion control uh, as it is right now, and I think that uh, at first, you know, we were very enamored with, with the new gameplay possibilities that opened up, but I think the people who had been into video games especially probably picked up on some of the shortcomings that tech has. Previous motion control only has very limited motion device in it. It just looks at the acceleration, it looks at, you know, the orientation, but now we actually have position. It is exciting because it's the first time it allows real one-to-one -one immersive action of the gamer into the game. It gives you six degrees of freedom. So what that means is it knows exactly like where your hand is and it knows exactly how your hand is facing. Nothing else gives you that. If I want to control a sword and I want to like hold it up high and block like this, I can do that. Or if I want to block low like that, or if I want to you know, come over to the side. So it gives you both the exact position and the orientation, which is, you know, that doesn't exist right now. So that's why it's so cool to work on it. I think the first time that I saw uh, what Sony was planning to do with motion control, it was probably how I felt the first time I was controlling like a 3D character in, in a 3D video game. And when I first saw the demos that Sony brought to us, and then we got to play them, and it was just reaching in and picking stuff up, and that's the same leap, I think. It really enables us to do like full 3D you know, tracking. It makes the user feel more involved in the experience. You know, if I press a button and do a special move, that's cool. But if I like, you know, execute, you know, some sort of special move, that's gonna be way cooler when that shows up on screen and I just completely dominate the guy. We found in development when you're playing this, the best way to succeed is if you can stop thinking about the screen in front of you. This is, you know, one to one, it's doing exactly what I want. Let's pretend there's a guy who's five foot eleven standing right in front of me. I'm just going to whack at him, and sure enough, boom. I think uh, the PlayStation 3 motion controller is going to open up opportunities for people, A, who haven't played motion control games before, both on the casual side and on the hardcore side. We're going to be able to deliver content to them that is fun and challenging and new. At the same time, I think we're going to be able to deliver content that, uh, you know, mom and the family will also enjoy. I'm extremely excited, and I just can't wait that, you know, people will see what, what we've done, what we've achieved.